To make a killing jar, mix plaster of Paris and water in the bottom of a glass jar. Leave it until it is dry, which might be about a day. Put some ripped paper towels in the jar to keep the insects from damaging themselves against the glass. This jar to the left is how the end product should look. Then you pour some ethyl acetate into the jar. Be very careful because ethyl acetate is very poisonous, so you should try not to inhale it. Also, when ethyl acetate is exposed to light, it loses its efficacy, so make sure to keep it in a dark container, either dark colored glass or in a tube wrapped in foil. If you have insects which are not fresh and they feel stiff, you will need to use a relaxing box to loosen them before pinning so that they don't break. Put oasis or florist's foam in a plastic container that can be closed tightly. Wet the oasis. The more water you use, the faster your insects will relax, but don't use too much water or your insects will rot in the relaxing box before you have a chance to pin them. Put a few layers of paper towel on top of the oasis. Two to three layers is usually sufficient. You can also use Dettol, Savlon, or another antibacterial soap to kill the bacteria and keep the insects from rotting and smelling bad, but this step is optional. Add some more paper towels. Then place your insects inside. Cover them with another layer of paper towel and close the lid tightly to keep the moisture in. Leave the box overnight or as long as it takes for the insects to relax. Thank you for watching our video on how to make a killing jar and relaxing box.